Welcome, and thank you for taking the time to learn a bit more about Commissioner Tools and the Unit Service Plan. This is a video lasting less than 10 minutes and is aimed to provide more information about the value and process for recording a simple assessment in the Commissioner Tools system. Before we move away from the introductory slide, please take note of the BSA Intellectual Property Statement shown here. If you need more time to read it, please pause now. The topics we will discuss will include what is a simple assessment, when to enter a simple assessment, how to enter the simple assessment, what a unit dashboard will look like, and the value of the assessment. We are starting at the unit dashboard on the units tab and select the add contact button. Using the drop down we select what type of unit meeting we have, if we're filling this out for somebody else, the date of our contact, what we feel is the status of their unit health, and what type of assessment we are doing. We are interested in a simple assessment so we select that button. We are taken to this screen where we scroll down to our next selection for an overall assessment score. This is selected using the 1 to 5 score range showing that includes half point increments. Simply click on the score you wish to assign. In this case we are assessing this unit's health at a 3.5. The next section is where we add comments. This is where you provide information about how the unit service plan is being implemented, special needs, good ideas you have seen at this unit, or anything else you deem relevant. You can enter as much information as you like. The form will expand to enter all of the information you want to include. You are almost done. Once you have completed these areas, you have two choices. If you realize that this entry is the wrong unit, or for some reason you don't want to complete this contact, you can hit the Delete Contact button shown on the left. If you are in fact ready to complete this simple assessment, all you need to do now is select the Save and Complete Contact button on the right corner. It is very important to know that if any button is selected other than this Save and Complete Contact button, that the contact will not be saved, but will be deleted or shown as in progress. With the selection of the Save Contact button, you have completed a simple assessment. Very quick and simple, just as the name implies. After selecting the Save Contact button, you are returned to the home screen for this unit, and this is what you will see. In this case, the simple assessment's health score was a 3.5. You now see this showing in the upper right corner with the yellow circle. You can also see that this assessment was a decline from the previous assessment, indicating a declining unit health score. Looking here, you will also see your latest assessment, either a simple or detailed, show up on the top line of the list of assessments with the unit health score you just assigned, the date of the assessment, that this was a unit assessment, the type of contact, and the name of the commissioner who made the contact. Take note of the two wavy lines on the top right side of the simple assessment score. This is called a tilde. This tilde indicates that your latest assessment was a simple assessment. Scores without this tilde indicate a detailed assessment. Scrolling back up the page, this is the health indicator area that would be populated when a detailed assessment is completed. As you just saw, a simple assessment does not provide the breakdown of information for the finance, membership, program, or leadership and governance areas. Since the latest assessment does not provide this, this area is not populated until a new detailed assessment is completed. Occasionally, you may have contacts that show as in progress. Journey to Excellence counts completed contacts, but not in progress contacts. The value of the contact is the information you enter, but be aware that for it to be counted in the Journey to Excellence totals, 
it will need to be completed and not just in progress. This concludes our orientation on completing a simple assessment. Please take the time to view the other videos about Commissioner Tools and the Unit Service Plan. If you have a question, please work with your area, council, or district champions to resolve any questions that you may have. Thank you again for taking the time to become a more informed Commissioner.